Okay, students, uh, now I'm going to discuss some extra questions of derivative. So uh, in previous lecture, you have uh, solved a question based on first principle. Okay, first principle se hum kaise differentiation karte wo padte. Ab hum kuch direct rules padenge. Ki kaise hum kuch aapko formula bataya gaya tha classes mein. I will explain some formula in the classroom. That is d upon dx of x to the power n. d by dx of x to the power n. That is n x to the power n minus 1. and also second formula differentiation of constant function is zero and some trigonometric function jaise like dy dx of sin x it is cos x dy dx of cos x it is minus sin x d upon dx of tan x so d by dx of tan x it is sec square x d by dx of sec x it is sec x tan x d by dx of sec x it is sec x It is sec x tan x d by dx of cot x. It is minus cosec square x d upon dx of cosec x. It is minus cosec x cot x. Okay. now some formula i will not uh, discuss in classroom uh, that is see here if uh, you have differentiate an exponential function if you have to differentiate an exponential function what is exponential function i will uh, tell in the classroom a function which is of the form e to power x exponential so it differentiation of e to power x and differentiation of logarithmic function d by dx of log x equal to 1 upon x base base is e d by dx of log x equal to 1 by x memorize it okay okay student uh, this question you see in this question what do you see in this question you see in this question find the derivative of cos square x take it is y equal Equal to x square into cos of x. So what uh, you see here, I think uh, you know uh, by which formula it is solved. So I explain you in previous lecture what product rule, Leibniz product rule. So what is Leibniz product rule? Product of two function is given. So up we can see here. differentiating with respect to x so it is dy by dx first function ko as it is hum rakhte hain differentiation karte hain second function ka to cos x ka differentiation cos x ka differentiation kya hota hai bhai anyone minus of sin x plus cos x is as it is and what is the differentiation of x square you see x square is of the form x to the power n so it is an x square minus 1 2x by 2 minus 1 means 2x okay the right down here or right as it is 2x into cos x minus x square sorry minus x square sin x okay 2x 2x cos x minus x square 
Okay, students. So this is your answer of this question. Okay. Now uh, move to the next question. Move to the next question. Next question is see here. Differentiate this. What uh, you see here? This is quotient rule. No. If you apply quotient rule, also solve it. But uh, without quotient rule, I am going to solve by without using quotient rule. So how? Anyone? Now I'll solve it. Just see on the board. What do you see here? Constate y equals to x square plus x plus one upon under root x. So you know, in fraction, we have to write down like it. Okay, so what it looks like, it looks like y equal to, so this is x to power 2 minus 1 by 2, x to the power 2 minus 1 by 2, x square minus 1 upon 2 plus x to the power 1 minus 1 by 2 plus x to the power minus 1 by 2. So you get the function 2 to the 4, 4 minus 1, 3 by 2 plus 1 minus half means x to the power half plus x to the power minus 1 by 2. And by using the formula this d by dx x to the power n equal to nx pay n minus 1. By using this formula, you have to differentiate. Differentiating with respect to x, this is dy by dx equal to 3 upon 2 nx pay n minus 1 plus 1 by 2 x k power 1 by 2 minus 1 plus minus 1 by 2 x to the power minus 1 by 2 minus 1. So it is 3 upon 2. It is 3 upon 2 x to the power. 3 by 2 minus 1 means 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2 x k power half minus 1 x k power minus 1 by 2 and this is you see this plus and minus makes it negative this plus and minus makes it negative so it is plus minus minus 1 by 2 x to the power minus of 3 by 2 this is your Answer. Okay, you also write it as 3 upon 2 under root x plus 1 by 2 under root x minus 1 upon 2 x to the power 3 by 2. You have to write also this. Okay, so what you see here, we have to break it into the sum of three functions and apply the differentiation. Okay, so differentiation is very easy but uh, learn step by step because it is very important chapter from your board point of view also from the competitive point of view so now i am going to move on next question that is a trigonometric question find the derivative of x plus cos x upon 10x what do you do here here you see it is a apply here quotient rule they am quotient rule lagate hain d by dx of u by v d by dx of u by v kya hota anyone कोई बताएगा भाई d by dx of u by v क्या होता है अब इसको तो क्लास में मैं डिस्कस भी कर चुका हूँ प्रीवियस वीडियो में भी इसको डिस्कस किया गया है आपके लिए तो एनीवन d upon dx u by v दिस इस कॉल्ड कोसेंट्रो v square v as it is d by dx of u minus u d by dx of v okay this is the quotient rule now here apply take y equal to x 
plus cos x upon 10 x x plus cos x upon 10 x. now differentiating now differentiating with respect to x so jaise differentiate karenge isko kya milega dy by dx equal to upon square of denominator jiska denominator ka square karte hain same denominator ko as it is rakhte hain aur differentiation kiska karte hain d by dx x plus cos x means numerator minus numerator ko as it is rakhenge aur kiska karenge differentiation d by dx of 10x d by dx of 10x okay students now it is 10x if you differentiation then x ka differentiation 1 cos x ka differentiation kya hota hai minus of sin x minus x plus cos x what is the differentiation of 10x it is sec square x abhi pichle uh, time mein likhe the question pehle upon 10 square x you have to write one step more so in one step more what do you have to write ek step aur likha jaye to aapka jo answer aayega wo kuch aisa aa jayega tan x 1 minus sin x minus sec square x x plus cos x whole upon tan square x whole upon tan square x this is your answer okay so student uh, here we can i am using which formula quotient formula okay you also use the quotient formula and uh, solve different questions from miscellaneous exercise you have solved some other questions from miscellaneous exercise i move to the next question and what is the next question i will discuss also some questions on logarithmic also so this is a very important question and uh, and then classroom you have to remove one the base type ka aapko milta hai ki 1 minus cos 2x upon 1 plus cos 2x us case mein hum kya karte hain 1 ko eliminate karte hain kaise 1 ko eliminate karte hain by using trigonometric formula aur wo kaun sa formula hai kuch log ke dimag mein aa bhi chuka hoga ki kis formula ki baat main kar raha hu so i am talking about half angle formula कुछ लोगों को अगर समझ में आ गया हो तो अच्छी बात है नहीं तो यू कैन सी ऑन द व्हाइट बोर्ड क्या देख रहे हैं आप लोग इस व्हाइट बोर्ड में कि मैं लिखने जा रहा हूं कॉस टू एक्स का फॉर्मूला इसलिए टिग्नोमेट्री बहुत ही इंपॉर्टेंट है लर्न ऑल द फॉर्मूला कॉस टू एक्स मीन्स वन माइनस टू साइन स्क्वायर एक्स मीन्स यहां से अगर आपसे पूछा जाए वट डू यू मीन बाई टू साइन स्क्वायर एक्स इट इज वन माइनस कॉस टू एक्स और इट इज ऑल्सो रिटेन एज टू कॉस स्क्वायर एक्स माइनस वन एंड वन मोर फॉर्मूला इज फ्रॉम वेयर इट इज क्रिएटेड कॉस स्क्वायर एक्स माइनस साइन स्क्वायर ओके सो आई एम यूजिंग दिस आई एम यूजिंग दिस फॉर्मूला फॉर सॉल्विंग दिस क्वेश्चन जस्ट सी हियर Firstly, let y equal to one minus cos two x. सबको मालूम है भाई कि हमको यहाँ पर क्या हटाना है? हमको यहाँ पे root को हटाना है, ठीक है? ये चीज़ आप लोग mind में रखिएगा. One minus. अब आप बताइए one कैसे eliminate होगा? अगर हम इस फॉर्मूले को ले लें तो माइनस हो गया तो ये प्लस हो जाएगा तो वन माइनस वन आपका कैंसिल हो जाएगा यानी यहाँ पर हम लिख सकते हैं वन माइनस वन और इस माइनस की वजह से जो अंदर ये माइनस है ये प्लस हो जाएगा और इट इज टू साइन स्क्वायर एक्स ओके नाउ वन प्लस कॉस टू एक्स सी हियर वन 
प्लस कॉस टू एक्स मीन हमको नेगेटिव वन चाहिए इट इज टू कॉस स्क्वायर एक्स माइनस वन अब आप यहां से क्या देख रहे हो आप देख सकते हो क्लियरली कि दिस वन इज कैंसिल आउट फ्रॉम दिस दिस वन इज कैंसिल आउट फ्रॉम दिस एंड वट डू यू राइट डाउन हियर तो यू राइट डाउन हियर इज अंडर रूट टू साइन स्क्वायर एक्स अपॉन टू कॉस स्क्वायर एक्स कैंसिल दिस एंड दिस एंड अंडर रूट टेन स्क्वायर एक्स यू गेट हियर टेन सो वाई इक्वल टू टेन एक्स अब हम इसे क्या करेंगे इजी वे में डिफ्रेंसिएट कर सकते हैं कैसे डिफ्रेंसिएट कर सकते हैं डिफ्रेंसिएटिंग विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू एक्स डिफ्रेंसिएटिंग विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू एक्स क्या मिलेगा डी वाई बाई डी एक्स इक्वल टू टेन एक्स का डिफ्रेंसिएशन क्या होता है भाई एनी वन इट इज सेक स्क्वायर एक्स इट इज सेक स्क्वायर एक्स ओके so students i'll move if any other question no but i'll take some other questions also to see you have to solve miscellaneous i am going to solve one question based on log find the derivative of log sin x so my question is my question next question is find the derivative of Find the derivative of log sin x. अच्छा आपसे अगर पूछा जाए क्वेश्चन है फाइंड द डेरीवेटिव ऑफ लॉग एक्स स्क्वायर लॉग एक्स तो क्या करेंगे भाई डी वाई बाई डी एक्स अभी आपको बताया गया कि log x का क्या होता है वन बाई एक्स ओके तो यहां से आप देख रहे हो कि log x का जो आपका होता है वन बाई एक्स होता है अगर आपका हम नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन दे दे फाइंड द डेरीवेटिव ऑफ लॉग ऑफ x square. Here we use the chain rule. Chain rule means firstly we consider it log x means x square is treated as x. So in differentiation we can write dy by dx equal to log x means one by x. But in place of x here x square. So one by x square and differentiating x square again. So it is one upon x square and differentiation of x square is two x. So x and x cancel out it is 2 upon okay my third question my third question my third question you differentiate y equals to log of sin x y equal to log of log of sin x log of sin x means 1 upon sin x okay log x sin x is treated as x so it is log x means 1 by x so log sin x 1 upon sin x and again differentiate sin x differentiation tab tak karte hain jab tak ki humko 1 not obtained ho jaye ab aap previous question dekho yahan pe x square ka kiye 2x ab x bach gaya x ka again hum karenge to kya milega humko 1 so my differentiation is and now here 1 by sin x and if we differentiate sin x it is if we differentiate sin x what it is it is cos of x and what is the differentiation of x it is 1 so it is cos x by sin x and cos x by sin x means cot x so log of sin x means cot x this is your answer okay So this is the application. Okay, students. Now you have uh, also solved sine a x plus b. If you write sine a x plus b, just in this place, I am going to solve one other question. Here, yeah. y equals to. This is the last question. Y equals to sine a x. Plus, so differentiate it. 
differentiating with respect to x dy by dx is equal to sin ax plus b and ax plus b is in bracket so ax plus b is treated as x so it is cos ax plus b and we in chain rule again differentiate ax plus b again differentiate ax plus b it is cos it is cos ax plus b and d by dx of ax is a and b is zero so it is a cos of ax plus b a cos of ax plus b this is your answer a cos of ax plus b okay students so you have to solve miscellaneous exercise and your homework is solve miscellaneous exercise okay and uh, in next lecture i will discuss some other questions also okay thank you